welcome back to another burn. Today we are working on a winter fairy of sorts. Um, I did draw this prior. I swear I did. Uh, I just didn't want to have to redraw her, so I decided to do what I usually do, and I usually um, cut out the drawing on the wood because then it just trans it in a way transfers it onto the wood. Um, this way I don't have to have that many pencil marks because generally it is impossible to get pencil marks out of wood. <laughs> uh, so here we are just cutting her out. Um, her and the mountains are being cut out. Everything else I will draw myself. Um, but yeah, so we're back to doing another speed burn. <laughs> I'm gonna have to figure out a name for this properly. I'm just gonna call it a speed burn for now because that's pre pretty much what it is. It's just me speeding up a burn that I did. Um, I did not record this, or I did not record this, <laughs> I did not stream this on Twitch this time around. I just recorded it because I didn't want to stream it per se. Um, last time I streamed, I burnt myself. This time I didn't, I promise. There's no foreshadowing this time around. <laughs> um, but yeah, so these ones are actually quite, uh, this one's actually quite a long burn compared to the other ones, where the other one was, I believe, 10 minutes and this one is 30 plus minutes. Um, so there's not much that I can <laughs> figure out what to say. Um... Yeah, we're on to the wings. <clears throat> the wings are not going to be burnt, um, like, fully. They're just going to be outlined. Um, while her herself is going to be, uh, silhouetted. That's what I should say. She's going to be a silhouette while the wings are not. Um, the mountains are going to be silhouetted and so are the trees. And the rest are just going to be lined out. You know, just to mix it up make it a little bit you know better so we finished cutting now we're just going to trace over the cuts with a pencil and then from there we're gonna actually uh draw the rest of the stuff <laughs> but this is this is generally what i actually do i draw out what i what i had planned on paper and then i do the rest then i cut it out and burn it on the wood and yeah, this is going to take a while. <laughs> I don't know exactly everything else I'm going to say during this. I really do hope that you guys enjoy these um, and do look forward to the other ones that I will be doing. Um, I do plan on doing a little bit more fairies. I do have a big one planned. Like it's going to be on a bigger canvas, so I'm going to have to figure out what I'm going to do for that or where I'm going to be recording it. I might record it on my bigger table because I need the room. <laughs> that is for sure. Or I'm just going to have to clear off the uh, the desk and figure it out from there. <laughs> um, I do have my, my rig that I probably will set up in a different area because where it is now, it's okay, but it's not the best because it's kind of like in my way in a way <laughs> uh, here we're on the trees this is usually how I do my trees I just you know kind of like shade them down and now we are on the snowflakes um, I had originally um, put the snowflakes sparsely um, on the drawing but because that was gonna fill it out by myself on the wood and I wasn't going to do a very like a lot of it on the drawing itself I mean the drawings not gonna be seen anymore it's just gonna be this um, I do add color you will see that later on in the video as well ah, here we are actually I'm sorry about that here we are actually plugging in my my burner um, because yeah, that kind of needs to be plugged in by this, by this time, because at this point in time, we are getting closer to the time that we will be burning. Um, and I believe we're using the fine tip point. Yeah, we are using the fine tip point at this, for this one, because it is line work, 
rather than filling in. Um, this is a new clip. <laughs> this is the clip where the burner is officially done and we are starting on burning the snowflakes. It's a little blurry, unfortunately, and I'm trying to fix that, but it's not really working. <laughs> the camera or my, my my phone wanted to focus solely on the burner and not the artwork i will figure out a way to make it so it's not so blurry or i'll figure out another camera to work with but for now i'm working with my phone so sometimes i can't listen to music <laughs> if i'm listening to it via phone uh, but yeah. So the reason why I came up with this idea was one, my aunt gave me the idea. Well, she gave me the idea of doing something with colors, um, and doing like almost like blowing of some sort, like blowing a pixie dust onto someone or something like that. Um, and then it was a humongous snowfall yesterday or at least should, i should say yesterday night um bef yeah yesterday night yesterday morning <laughs> was really big snowfall and it was just snow everywhere so i'm like what if i do it where she's blowing snowflakes and i have the colors i had the idea i didn't have paper while i was out and about um, I regretted that, and then I just had to try and remember it until I got back home, and there's a cat. <laughs> so when we got back, when I got back, did everything I needed to do, sat down on my bed, and started to draw. And when I finished drawing, and I'm like, I actually like this. Um, I'm gonna you know, send it to a few people, see what they think, and if they like it, then I'm going to start burning it. And I did say my new burn, and then a lot of them really liked it, and they were like, oh, that's going to be really nice. So I'm like, that's it. We're burning it. <laughs> I could have streamed it. I probably should have streamed it, because I don't stream a lot. But I didn't stream it. Uh, and I just recorded it. And, yeah. I mean... This is where I am right now. <laughs> We're still on the snowflakes. The snowflakes take a while because I'm doing four lines per snowflake. And then I still have to burn her. That's going to be fun. Um, I did re I did, I did um, learn a new trick to help with, uh, with your bits with, um, with burning. Is to, while it's hot, use sandpaper and or um which you'll see now sandpaper or a wire brush of sort to um kind of like scratch away the carbon i think I, I can't remember what it's called but the stuff that accumulate on the bits which actually help a whole lot like it just makes everything so much easier and I did not realize this until way too late and now I just have to do it with the rest of my bits one of these days or do it as I burn but yeah we're working on the fairy now the snowflakes are done and yeah <laughs> okay I hate hands I can never do hands so the hands are never the best I'm just it's it's a silhouette if it wasn't the silhouette then i would try and do the best with the hands but i can't do the hands so i'm not doing the hands <laughs> the hands can go away forever i don't think anyone can do hands properly well people that can do hands are like immensely amazing i can do human hands while looking at the hand but give me a cartoon hand and i'm like huh where it's usually it's the opposite way around people can't do human hands but they can do um cartoon hands and i'm like yeah no no i can't do that even feet even feet like i just i just i can't do cartoon feet the like really well and i could do i could do human feet because i'm looking at the human feet i'm a person by sight rather than mind 
where sometimes I can do mind and sometimes I can do sight. Like the mountains and the trees and the flakes were all mind. But of course, I had to, you know, see little ideas of what I could do for the fairies. Um, and that was by sight. But I drew it all by hand. Um, back to the sandpaper. But yeah, like, if you're doing this and you start to have a hard time burning and it's because it's not burning yet well, sandpaper it. <laughs> sandpaper, sandpaper, sandpaper. It is literally life. Not really, but it is literally a lifesaver when it comes to burning. We're back to the wings. Um, yeah. <laughs> I don't know what else I'm saying anymore right now. Um, I personally, I enjoy doing these. These are a lot of fun. They're relaxing, calming. Um, the only time that it's not calming is when you accidentally burn yourself. <laughs> but it's only once. It is only once so far that I have done, that I have burnt myself. Um, and it was just a small little burn and it only hurt for a little bit and not that long. So it was nothing. It was nothing. Um, but yeah. So we're almost done wings. And then once we finish the wings, then we are going on to the mountains. And then after we fin finish the mountains, then we're filling her in. And through after filling her in, we're doing the trees. And then... We finish with the burning, or at least for now. The, there's extra burning later on where we do the border, which I wasn't sure what I was going to do for the border. There was um, debate between ribbon, three different kinds of ribbon. Um, there was twine that I would have done, just a simple border with twine, or I could have burned it. Um, I was given the, uh, the idea of the one ribbon didn't turn out well i didn't i didn't film any of that but the one ribbon didn't look that well or at least none of the ribbons did actually and then um i was then i get i was given the idea of uh of burning so i was just like you know what okay let's try burn let's try a design and it took me a bit actually it took me a sleep <laughs> to realize what kind of burn that I wanted to do um, and then after I figured out the burn I did the burn and you'll see what the burn looks like momentarily or well later on in the video not momentarily it's very much not momentarily <laughs> we're on the mountains now the mountains, the, these ones are easy. They're simple. Um, I've done mountains before and they were a lot more intricate than this one. I didn't really care to do uh, very intricate mountains for this because I didn't want to take away from the intricacy of these, of the fairy and the snowflakes. Because they, these, this is, these, the mountains are more mundane than anything, and yes, I do use mundane a lot <laughs> in a lot of my speaking now. My vocabulary has mundane in it. <laughs> um, I don't know what I'm saying anymore. <laughs> but yeah, uh, the mountains are, um, they're, they're simple, not really, um, that important in the, in, in this. It's just like, uh, background. It's almost just like a background character. They're there for um, aesthetics and to make make the whole thing look good and then but it's not as important as the main as the main focus and the main focus is the fairy with the with the snowflakes and right now we are erasing um, any pencil marks that I can find that were not cut in um, most of the time the pencil marks don't come out and these ones were being nice to me oddly enough. <laughs> This is also, I'm trying to wait for, um, for the, my next burner to, uh, my next bit to heat up because I had to cool it down first to change it, to then heat it up, to then use it for the next part of this, which is the filling in part. But right now we are erasing, erasing anything and everything <laughs> that we can. Um, 
yeah, clean off the space and start burn. Start to burn. I try and burn along where you where it would generally look like. Mm, so if it's hair, I will try and go along with the way that the hair would move. And for a body part, for like the body itself, then I will try and burn along the way that, you know, you would expect to see the body to be burned. <laughs> if that makes any lick of sense. I don't know anymore. <laughs> I'm just trying, just like thinking of anything and everything for this because I'm just like, I don't know what to say. This one's a lot longer than the other one. The other one was a lot faster. This one's a lot longer because there's more intricacy and stuff like that. And I probably should have made this a little bit faster, but I didn't want to make it too fast because if it was too fast, then it would just be like, whoa, what the hell did I just watch kind of thing where this one's not too fast, but not too long because it technically, so according to video wise, it took me two and a half hours um before i cut it down to like 30 to 40 minutes <laughs> um and then but in reality it took me longer because i had to wait for it to cool down to heat up i fell asleep for a bit because um i have a chest cold uh so yeah it's just like a whole lot of um a whole lot of everything <laughs> uh here we are on the trees at first they look a little sparse or they don't look that best they don't look the best they're not, they're not very silhouetted so i do change that later on i promise because <laughs> i don't want to keep it like this because it just it doesn't look that good if it's just like this so um i do change it i do fill it in a little bit more once i generally get the rest of the fairy filled in because i realized that i only did half of her and I still have a whole other half of her to do. I just figured might as well just get these done and over with for now. And then I'll continue on the fairy. Which I do. I try and fill it in a little bit here. Um, but it's still not enough. So I do work on it a little later. But first, the fairy. So yeah, I try and kind of go along the lines of the way that the clothing or the body works because it just it looks better. At least in my eyes, it looks better that way. A little bit more realistic, I would say. Yeah, it's taking forever. This is such... <laughs> I should have made it a little shorter. Oh well. Oh well. You live and you learn. <laughs> so how's everyone doing? How's everyone um, holding up during all of this craziness in this world? <laughs> Tell me in the comments down below. Have you gone insane yet? <laughs> I, swear, I swear I have. Actually, no. Um, I've been doing okay myself. I, I'm used to being held up in doors so i'm just like eh, it's just another another monday morning <laughs> actually i did do this on a monday so um we're filling in the mountains now and then we'll work on the trees again after the mountains are done i forgot about the mountains actually to be quite honest um I didn't also realize that I was going to be doing a border. I didn't think of I didn't think of it at the time cuz it didn't register in my mind at the time. But I'm really happy with the border that I came up with. You'll see it once we get to that point. I really hope that you guys enjoy it as well. Um that little I did do a little oopsie. <laughs> um when you saw me kind of like scratch a little bit at the board that was me doing a little oopsie or trying to see if i can get rid of a little oopsie but oh well now we are filling in the trees officially making them darker making them more silhouetted and everything which is which i i liked how they turned out um i do find that 
Um, I do like the ba- I do like working with a with bamboo um, board a little bit different, a little bit more because it does have a nice dark tint to it, where these ones are a lot lighter. But most of the bamboo things are all um, cutting boards, and they only have certain you know sizes for cutting boards, and these are all canvases. Um, and because they're on cutting boards, they have a film to it. So, um, usually they, usually when you, when you have a wooden cutting board, um, and if you have any design on it or anything, you usually put this, um, this topping to it to make it, you know, food, food grade safe and stuff like that. So that's what they have on it. And it makes it a little bit hard to burn, but I do agree that the darker wood is a little nicer than the lighter wood, but I do I do like the lighter wood and it is as canvas. If there is a bamboo canvas, I would bloody work with that in seconds. But you know what? This is good enough. All right, so we are done with the filling in, and that means it is time for the colors. Those ones are for the wings, and these ones are for the snow. Yeah. I do um, the thumbs up a lot. Fair warning. <laughs> I do it a lot. I don't know why. Um, but yeah, so the first first green I thought was going to be darker, but it the, the, the glitter is darker, but the stuff the glitter is in is, is clear, which I find is kind of stupid. Where the lighter green has lighter glitter, but it has a, um, but the stuff that it's in has color to it. So it makes what I did here completely, like, useless. It's the same with the blue. And I'm like, okay, this is inconveniencing, but... Uh, we'll work with it and I did fix it and it does look good. So yeah, like right here you can see that there's um, I don't know if you can see it, but there's a difference in uh, The fact that this one has color to the to the jelly stuff. That's that uh, that is being that the glitter is in Which is very annoying. <laughs> I didn't know it if I did I would have um, Changed the way that I had it, but the way that I fixed it. It looks good. Even the finished product looks good. <laughs> Just saying. I, I do really, and I did really enjoy doing this. And I really, I'm, I'm always nervous working with color. I can never get the color right. I never, it never looks good when I'm done. And it's just, it's, it's really annoying to work with the color. But, um, this one, it turned out really well. And I'm really, really glad that it did. Alright, so we finished the green, and now we're going to work on the blue, momentarily. So these are all just freshly open, so they have like these little bits, pieces on top of it that I have to get rid of, and then, so that's why it takes a little bit long to open some of them at some points. <laughs> Alright, and I did change the, um, uh paintbrush that's what it's called because I don't want green in the breath <laughs> don't need green in the snow that's not good I also made sure to pick up just you know paintbrushes that aren't super expensive and whatnot so but yeah but yeah here it is still the the dark blue is technically with clear um clear stuff so it's just like how is this a dark blue when it's it's just the glitter that's dark but everything else isn't it, it's it's stupid and then the light blue has the color and I'm just like what the heck this isn't working but I fix it I do I do mess around with the colors a little bit after this too as well but yeah so we I wanted to do where it went a gradients between the darker um, color to a lighter color and then with the snow it was from the dark blue to the light blue to the silver but it was more like a light blue to a dark blue to a silver 
That's what it, that's what it looked like. Or at least, I don't know. It didn't do it as well as I would have wanted it to. So we're on the silver now. Um, I didn't do where all the snowflakes is silver because that's not what I was planning. Um, where I did silver is technically in a sense where the breath is or where it's supposed to be accumulated the most. And then after that, the rest of the snowflakes are just like falling down. So that's kind of what I did. And I think it looks good. I like it. I hope you guys like it. But yeah. Just, just gonna... Word. <laughs> Wait till it's, you know, done to continue. I'm trying to think of anything else to say. Um, I've been... I've been wood burning for uh, I think two two weeks prior to Christmas or a couple or maybe four or maybe a month before Christmas I think I started wood burning uh, my brother bought me or got or got me my wood burner for Christmas which I'm really happy about um, so I don't have to keep borrowing my mom's <laughs> I can give it to back to her with when I give her back her uh, cricket um, but yeah, so yeah, we're just filling in the area that wasn't good enough <laughs> with the good blue, and we're doing the same thing with the with the with the green. Yeah, just fill that in. We're just doing little touch-ups now at this point before I actually start on the border. So we're almost done. <laughs> It's almost done. You almost had, you don't you don't have to listen to my voice anymore after this, as I'm getting tired of it too. <laughs> We're almost there. We're on the last stretch. All right. At this point, um, I'm doing like one more time, like one more time with the silver, which is what I was doing with my finger. Just like one more, right here, one more. <laughs> yep. You know, fill it in a little bit, make it a little bit, you know, better. Because it was a little sparse when I when I did it, so we're filling it in. I didn't do, I didn't, I didn't un or unpeel the, I didn't peel off the tape for you guys. I apologize. If I do it again, then um, if I end up doing another border like this, and I will, I'll do it. I promise. <laughs> I'll, I'll, I'll do the, uh, the, pe the peel off, but yeah. Here, I am, um, I've realized that I did the border off camera because I wasn't sure exactly. Um, checking to see if it's, um, hot enough to burn and it wasn't hot enough. So that was like a no go. <laughs> and here, um, after about like maybe a, a couple more minutes, it was ready to burn. But yeah, so I did the, um... The border off camera because I wasn't sure exactly what I was gonna do for the border and I was just kind of like if him and Han on what to do and then I figured out I did the uh, the like what I'm doing right now I did the snowflakes first actually I did the, two, the four corners first and then I did the um, did the swirly whirls <laughs> or the waves not swirls they're waves and then I did the uh, the smaller snowflakes, but for this one I'm doing the snowflakes first to burn, and then I will do the the waves right after. But these ones they have um, they have like the circles in the middle to make the make them a little bit more um, personal or not personal, but uh, different, a little bit more special. <laughs> Yeah, I'm tired. If you haven't, if you didn't know. Uh, but yeah, so I am also working with my mag with my magnifying glass. So um, I try and keep everything close to me. <laughs> I just realized that if you look to the side, you can see me breathing. Like I'm just like breathing. It looks like I'm breathing like, super duper fast, but it's just because I'm doing this like super du I sped up the video like super duper fast so I'm like breathing like <laughs> it's 
It's kind of funny. I like it. I'm getting distracted. I didn't even realize that till now. And you probably didn't even realize that till now. Welcome to my mind. <laughs> Anyways, uh, but yeah. Um, I do, I do like the smell of, um, of this, of this wood when I burn it. It's, it's a pretty nice smell. Um, it's not the same as burning live edge wood. Live edge wood being burnt, oh, it's just, I wish I could have, I could only burn with live edge, but that stuff is expensive. This stuff is from the dollar store. Like, Okay, Dollarama, and it's four bucks. Like, at least these ones are four bucks. I can't remember what the other ones were cost. Um, I know the bigger ones are a little bit more expensive, and the smaller ones are a little less expensive. But, yeah, no. It's generally four bucks per, um, per canvas. And then four bucks for the, uh, um, cutting boards. So, it's just like, it can be kind of, um, it's not pricey. That's, that's good, but it still is kind of pricey, <laughs> at least for someone that, you know, doesn't have a lot of money. But anyways, we're on the, um, we're on the, the, the waves now at this point. Um, if there is any ideas that you guys might think of that you might want me to do, do tell me in the comments down below. Um, like I said, there is going to be another fairy one, but it's going to be a lot bigger than this one. Like, this is one fairy. What I'm planning on doing is doing, like, um, like, a colony of fairies. I don't know if that's what you would technically call it or not. Um, but it's just a bunch of fairies and a really big tree. And there's going to be some gnomes and there's going to be some birds and bugs and, you know, like, a oh, humongous picture. This one was just a simple one. But that one's in the future. It'll be, it'll happen eventually. Just not yet, but eventually. I just have to, you know, draw it out first. That's the biggest thing. And I will try and draw it while on camera. So you guys can see that I actually draw my stuff. <laughs> I promise I do. I do, I do, I do. I know I do, I know I do. Okay, I'm being really weird right now. I'm being really crazy. Uh, so we're almost done. Um, but yeah, so I can't remember if I do anything else after this. I don't think I do. I think I just show it off a little bit. Maybe not. I don't remember. But yeah, I think yeah, I think I do uh, show it off a little bit. Just be like, yo, this is what it looks like. Um, and then it'll be done, and then that's when my outro will come out. And yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this. Well, and if you like it, hit the thumbs up. If you want to see more, hit the subscribe button. And if you want to be notified, press the bell button, the bell icon. Um, but yeah. Oh, I forgot. I have to do my signature. I still need to work on signature. Um, <laughs> but yeah, if you if you guys like it, definitely hit that likes up, um, likes up button, words, the thumbs up button. That's the word. <laughs> And if you, if you have any ideas of anything to do, just tell me in the comments down below.